Seth Durr. Seth graduated from Tuscarawas Valley High School where he lettered in football, basketball, and track and field. He was first team All-Ohio in football in 1994 and 1995. Played linebacker at the College of Worcester where he was a three-time All-American and the school's all-time leading tackler. The Gagliardi Trophy finalist, which is the NCAA Division III Football Player of the Year Award, fourth player in NCAC history to be first team all-conference all four years, played professionally one summer in Germany, later returned to the College of Worcester as defensive coordinator, head football coach at Beloit College for six years, and inducted into the College of Worcester Hall of Fame in 2011. Please welcome into the Tuscarawas County Sports Hall of Fame, Seth Durr. Thanks so much. I'm honored to be here, and uh, I just want to say a few words. Uh, first of all, to the committee, this is a, a great thing, and I really appreciate your hard work for, for putting this together. Um, specifically, um, Connie Evans, who's not here tonight. Uh, I, I was able to be in Connie Evans' classroom at Tusky Valley growing up, and I'm sure that uh, her advocacy is a large part of me being here um, this evening. There's no um, shortage of people who were really helpful in me getting here, and I really need to thank many of them. But um, first and foremost, had some great coaches, and, and one of which is two of which who are here tonight. But my high school coach, Dale Martini, Dale uh, came to Tusky Valley in the fall of 1993 and really resurrected our program. He instilled a confidence in me that I um, didn't think I had, and, and certainly. Uh, fired up a passion for me for the game of football and competitiveness at that time. So thank you, Dale. Also, uh, my college coach, Mike Schmitz, is here with us tonight. Uh, Mike was the head coach at the College of Worcester during my time. And, and Mike recruited me, coached me, and also mentored me as a coach. So oh, so much to him uh, during my time. Um, my family, I cannot state enough of how much I'm thankful to have the people in my life as I look back and what I've been able to accomplish to, to be here and just the other things in my life. I'm, I'm grateful to have so many great people in my life. Um, I have three aunts here tonight that I'm very thankful for. Uh, Brenda, Chris, and Joanne, thank you for your attendance and being here. Uh, my wife, Lindsay, and my daughter, Alexandra, I love you. Thank you so much for being here. Um, and I was the youngest of three boys in, uh, in our family. Grew up in a, uh, on a farm outside of uh, Bolivar in the northern part of the county. And um, when I look back, I, and especially about Tuscross County, I think about the tremendous childhood I had. And um, I'm sure my brothers, one of which Aaron and his wife Amy are here tonight, thank you for being here, would attribute to them beating the crap out of me with their, with their buddies to my toughness. Um, which I, I agree with in, in a lot of ways. So thank you, Aaron, for that. Um, and Zach, who's, who's not here. But um, when I think about my childhood and how I got here, I think a lot about um, growing up on uh, the farm that I grew up on, Stonegate Farm. Uh, my late mother, Claudia, my dad, uh, Dale, who's here. Many of you know him as Dr. Dale, takes care of your dog, your cat, from the Town & Country Veterinary Clinic. Um, on the side, um, he decided that we would just have a farm and we would do that the other hours that he was not in the clinic. And so I certainly learned a lot about hard work and family and community from that. But the one thing that uh, we had always was um, athletics in our life. Our farm doubled as an athletic complex for Tusky Valley for the northern part of the county. The front yard was, or the front pasture was could be a baseball diamond, could be a, a football field. We had a, a basketball court in our barn. And so we always were working, but at the same time, if people wanted to come out, mom and dad said, go play, it's fine. So I cannot imagine a better upbringing. And so I'm proud to call T County my childhood home. And I'm uh, honored to be a part of this group. Thank you so much.